guys we're finally here it's car show season finally and also finally is the fact that we actually have good weather for once so i originally planned on coming here uh yesterday but it ended up raining quite a bit so i could not unfortunately come which I, the funny part was that it rained till like 10 11 o'clock and then it just stopped and then there was no rain after that so yeah typical me right or tip my typical luck i should say but welcome to the 2024 Corvette Expo Chevrolet in the Smokies car show. It's the third straight year covering this event. I'm looking forward to it. Always awesome to see some nice Corvettes and some nice Chevrolets. I've heard some stuff about what's going to be here. I think I've heard that uh, companies are bringing, now bringing two Corvette E-Rays. I've never seen two, uh, never seen one E-Ray, not unless two. So I'm looking forward to hopefully seeing those cars. Boys over there, Mad Bow Tiger Eyes, they got a couple cars lined up. And I've also heard some YouTubers are also around here. Like I said, Mad Bowtie Garage, buddies of mine. Ronna's Radar, I believe she said she, said she was going to be here all week. Daily Misfire was going to be here, I believe. So we got a couple of YouTubers from locally around the area coming down here, which is awesome. Hope you guys enjoy the show. Sit back and relax. Uh, um, at the very end of the video, I will let you guys know of another car show we'll be heading to next week. We're going to have some fun today, guys. Test out my new camera and everything, too. It's my first time bringing out my DJI Osmo Action 4. Be recording this entire video in 4K. As always, if you guys enjoy the video, hit that like, hit that subscribe button, and uh, as always, guys, welcome to the 2024 car show season. Let's go have some fun.
ladies and gentlemen, that will conclude this year's Corvette Expo and Chevy and the Smokies 2024. 47 years of this show. That's a long time. Overall, great show. It's always been a great show every single year. Um, I enjoy all the Corvettes, all the Chevrolets that show up in the show. A lot of pretty good cars. So, one thing I'm going to do for my videos, if I remember to do it, is that I want to talk about my favorite cars that I've seen from the show. Now that this is technically two shows combined into one, I want to talk about them separately. So, I'm going to talk about my favorite Corvette, and then I'm going to talk about my favorite Chevrolet from the Chevy and the Smoky side, if that makes sense. So, so to start, my favorite Chevrolet, or my favorite Corvette, would have to be, it's a close one between the wide body one that's up front. Wait, hold on. I had to show that, that was cool. Didn't expect that showing up. <laughs> um, but my favorite Corvette probably had to be the I think it's the Mad Vet one that has the cellular, cellular I can't talk. It's, a, it's got a blue wrap, basically. I'll show it on video, but the colors on that car look amazing. I liked every everything about it. Um, the CAs, there were a lot of CAs on that show also, but I think that one kind of just popped out to me in terms of just color and just the way the car looked. Um, I think that, uh, I think it's called Vuzo something. You'll see it in the video, but it's basically the wide body one at the very front of the uh, convention center so that one was really really good but I think I just like that the Mad Bet uh, one better Mad Bet's got some bangers from the last several years they they produce some really cool custom Corvettes so shout out to them they're really cool and then talking about my favorite Chevrolet it had to be that 60 I think it's a 65 uh, Chevrolet Corsair I never thought I would ever say that ever but that car was just I don't know I loved it <laughs> It kind of, it's like, it kind of just reminded me a little bit of a JDM car in a way, so, and it would not be fun. Huh. Yeah. I know who said that. I was like, who said that? The Speedster J. Uh, the Speedster J, my YouTube. Uh, what's up, YouTube? What's going what's on, good? guys? What's, good? what's up? <laughs> well, that was cool. <laughs> but that will be it for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoy the video. And I hope you guys, uh, let me some feedback on this 4K. We'll see how it goes from here on out because I know 4K will eat up a lot of just storage and that kind of stuff. So I might have to go and buy some bigger micro SD cards. That might be the go-to play for this. But that will be the plan for here on out. But uh, if you guys like the 4K, if it looks good, just let me know. If it, it doesn't, then I'll try to switch it up. Or if it gets kind of too difficult for me to kind of do because i mean i do have to transfer these files from my computer or from the dji over to my computer and cumulative wise it's been already been a huge amount of storage i've already used just getting footage if it gets too big i might just i can go always go to 1080 60 or something like that so we'll find out but i also want to give a big shout out to the the car community itself in general uh, talked to a lot of people today. Talked to a lot of uh, content creators. Uh, Daily Mess Fire was there. Talked to him for a little bit. Uh, Mad by Tiger Garage has t had two cars in, in the show itself. Um, there were a lot of other content creators that were also there. So, But yeah, a lot of content creator creators were there. I really enjoyed that. So That will be it for you guys today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to get in my car and take off this jacket because, oh my gosh, I'm sweating. It's hot now. It was hot this morning, but now it is. Do whip it and drive! Take a low stop! You gotta love it. And on that note, guys, I'll see you guys at the very next car show. Take care. God bless. Have a good one.